What's going on guys? In my last video I mentioned that I lost a lot of fish out of one of my main tanks uh, because of ick, um, aka white spot disease. And I wanted to go over some of the medicines that I used and what worked and what didn't so that you guys don't go through the same thing that I went through. So uh, my local fish store recommended this product to use. Um, it's General Cure by API and it's a powder and you treat the tank and then you, you do it again two days later and then two days after that you do a water change. So I, I started the four day treatment and I noticed that my fish were actually getting worse. I started seeing even more, more uh, larger white spots. I saw you know, more kind of erratic swimming and just uh, you know, all, the, all their symptoms that were, were even getting worse. So a couple of days into the treatment I, I started doing some research on this and even though this product is good for a lot of different things like hole in the head and bloat and things like that it's actually not a good choice for ick um, matter of fact this company API makes a, a medicine called I think super ick cure so it's a specific medicine for ick this one you can be fooled by the title of it general cure you kind of assume that it's kind of a, a cure-all, but it, it is good for a lot of things. That's why they call it general cure, but um, it's actually not good for ick. So if you're not sure what your fish have, then you're gonna probably have to use a combination of things. Um, but I started, after three days, I started using this stuff. I was actually looking for something called ick X, but they didn't have it at my local store. So I grabbed this stuff, it's by Jungle, it's called Ick Clear. And they're tablets, you know, you, you treat basically every 24 hours with water changes and, until your you know, fish are better. But this does turn your water blue. Um, it says on here that it doesn't stain anything in your tank. That's not quite true either. If you have anything like anything clear, clear tubing, suction cups, any white sponges in your in your um, hang on the back or your canister filter, it will be stained blue. So, and if you get this stuff on your clothes or your carpet, it's going to stain. So just be wary of that. But this actually worked pretty good. Um, uh, let's see. So basically, and then there's other products too. This one is also by Jungle. This is called Parasite Clear. I think this is better for like hookworm and things like that. It has different active ingredients than this product, which is made by the same company. And this has totally different active ingredients uh, for general cure. So if you're 100% sure what your fish have, then get medicine specific to what they have. And if you're not 100% sure what your fish have, don't freak out. You're gonna have to use a combination of things. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it the Cory treatment because he's the one that kind of came up with it, you know, if you follow Corey from Aquarium Co-op. He uses, you know, he owns a fish store, if you guys don't know who he is, and um, it's pretty popular on the YouTube fish keeping uh, network. And basically all of his fish get quarantined with three different products. This one, General Cure. Uh, there's also a product by API called Erythromycin, which is an uh, antibiotic. So this product with Erythromycin, which is going to, the box is going to look just like this, except it's going to say Erythromycin instead of General Cure. So those two things plus Ick X, which is a liquid and I believe you do like one teaspoon per 10 gallons. Um, those three things together are as close to a cure-all in the fish keeping hobby as you're gonna find. And that pretty much will cover just about anything parasitic, anything bacterial, and Ick specifically. So uh, again, don't, don't let this fool you. This, this is not going to cure everything. It is, I'm not making this video to try to say this is not a good product. I'm making this video to say that this is not an ick specific product. So, um, you know, this is good for a lot of different things, but it is not an ick medicine. Uh, if, you know, if your fish have ick, you know, get something for ick. And if you're not sure, then, then do uh, the Cori treatment, which is ick X. And then two products by API General Cure and erythromycin and that's gonna you know pretty much be, be the um, closest thing to a cure-all that, that we're gonna get in the hobby so anyway just wanted to go over some medicines and uh, hopefully clear some things up for you guys before you start doing it this is this is stuff you never want to have to use but 
it's always good to have it on hand in case you do need it and it's good to know you know what the medicines are good for and what they're not good for as well Alrighty, till next time thanks bye